It reads, this is God's, um, this is God's word on the subject. As soon as Babylon's 70 years are up and not a day before, I'll show up and take care of you as I promised and bring you back home. I know what I'm doing. I have it all planned out. Plans to take care of you, not to abandon you, to give you the future you hope for. Now, wow, look what he said. To give you the future who hope for. Did it say God in that scripture? It said to give you the future you hope for. Amen. God's grace toward you is so great that even though you deserve to be where you are, he's using it to make your dreams come true. Even though you deserve the punishment that we're experiencing now, even though we're the one that got ourselves in this mess, even though we were the ones that led ourselves astray, even though we were the ones, it was our shortcomings, it was our mess, it was our hiccups, it wasn't our friends, it wasn't our family, it was us. It was us, the one in the mirror, it was us who got us in the trouble that we're in now. But in spite of that situation, in spite of that mess, God is saying, I'm going to use the situation you created, the problems you created to make your dreams come true. I'm going to use where you are right now, as bad as it is, as serious as it is, as uncomfortable as it is, as embarrassing as it is, I'm going to use this situation to make your dreams come true. I'm going to use this situation to bring you to a place of blessing, to a place of prosperity, to a place of peace that you can never think about. Amen? In spite of ourselves, in spite of us, in spite of us, what an awesome God we serve. That even in our mess, even in our shortcomings, even in our problems, God is still, God is not pointing the finger and saying, oh, you did so-and-so, and you did so-and-so, and you did so-and-so, you did so-and-so. He's not pointing the finger. All he's saying is, you know what? I'm going to use it to better you. Because notice he didn't condemn. Where in the scripture did he condemn you? Did he convict? He didn't even convict us in this situation. All he's saying is that, you know what? Even though, even though I have all the right in the world to judge you right now, I'm not going to do it. Wow. Even though I have all the right in the world to just let you go on about your business and live your life until you die. Amen? He's saying here, no, I'm not going to let that happen. I'm not going to abandon you. I'm going to use it for, my, for your glory. I'm going to use it to manifest myself to you. I'm going to use it to show you just how much I love you. Just how much I care about you. 